A remarkable story of recovery. An Army veteran from Omaha fighting his way back to the game he loves. Here's 3 News Now reporter Molly Hudson. Uh, That's a good layup. Good ball. There you go. Way to go, Shorty. This probably sounds like any other afternoon of golf. That is you. I hit it this far. You hit it this far. He hit the ball this far. But for these four, it's a moment right. two years in the making. Boom! Like that. And away we go! Woo! As Gary Chalupa puts it, sometimes life just gets in the way. In July of 2021, these four went on their annual golf bus trip. We drive someplace, play golf for three days, and then come home. That year, Gary had been diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, underwent chemo, and got vaccinated against COVID-19 ahead of the trip. We went to Kearney that year, and coming home Tuesday, I had a scratchy throat. Days later came the COVID-19 diagnosis. At the time, he was living in Texas. Gary and his wife went home from Nebraska, and he found himself in the emergency room. The doctor said right away he had to put me on a ventilator. Um, I, he gave me enough time to call my wife and say goodbye. Uh. That was August 2021. Doctors induced a coma and Gary remembers waking up in November of that year. In all, 193 days in the hospital. I couldn't stand up. I couldn't raise my arms. I couldn't feed myself. I mean, I, I had no muscles at all. But through it all, this Army veteran had a mission on his mind. First, leaving the hospital, then getting back to the golf course with his brothers. You know, in the military, the, the job's not done till the goal's met. Two years later, Gary made his way home to Omaha and the tee box. It's good to be back. Welcome home, brother. Does it, does you forgive me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Turning the corner to see faces he hasn't seen in years. It, it, it kind of meant that I'm human. Um, made me shed a tear. I'm not crying, you are. <laughs> it's, Love you. it's the friends and family. Now I won't be able to putt. Like, sometimes life just gets in the way, uh, but you, 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 you overcome. You do, you do something different. In Benson. And away we go. Molly Hudson, 3 News Now. Dad would be proud. You, had, you, had, you had to one up me, didn't you? <laughs> Gary told Molly this is the first round of golf, but there are many more to come. It's a really special story, Mark. And can you imagine those hugs? How good that felt? I mean, imagine, I mean, not being able to stand up, no muscles. I mean, you just imagine being in the bed that long and then getting back to golf which uses so many muscles, I mean. It's amazing, he played nine holes and it's just a matter of getting the strength up to get in 18, but for everybody to be able to reunite on the course, so special, well he done Molly. Probably still undershoot me <laughs> on those nine. My money's on him too.